hey everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so welcome to tech world guys so today i have a very useful video for you guys now today i will uh, discuss about the checksums and how you calculate the checksums and uh, verify uh, some checksums of some particular file now first of all you have to know that uh, what is checksum the checksum is basically a hash value of a particular data or file and that uh, can be generated through and check some function or some complicated algorithm now this checksum is actually used to check the data integrity suppose uh, you have a, a particular file okay so if you uh, do or if you uh, generate uh, a particular checksum from that file so it will give you a hash value okay some some digital value and if suppose the main file is tempered or manipulated somewhat then again if you apply the checksum function so it will give different value so that you can easily detect that this file is not the original one so if the checksums are same then you can say that the data is same that is that is the original data or the original file now you know that uh, in my channel uh, i have uh, uh, reviewed many of the linux distributions and when you download an iso file of a linux distribution uh, it must be genuine it is very essential that you should use the correct iso file now you know that uh, any data or iso file can be shared through torrent networks or it is available uh, suppose anywhere in the internet so first of all you must download the uh, iso files of any linux system through the official website sites and they provide uh, the checksums of that particular iso file so you must verify that checksums so in this video uh, let's see that uh, how you can generate and verify the checksums of some uh, iso files and in this video i will do this in my windows 11 machine so if you have a windows machine uh, suppose windows uh, 7 or 10 or 11 whatever so so this this uh, will be very helpful to you and here I will show the easiest way, not the command line way. I will show you guys the easiest way that is the graphical way that how you can generate and verify the checksums. Okay. And I, I searched a lot of software and uh, two softwares or you can say three softwares. Okay. Uh, I, I have found that those are very much useful. So just I'm showing you guys. Uh, this is the first software. Okay. So this is called the MD5 and SHA checksum utility. So this is an amazing uh, software and it is uh, free to use okay for the personal use and suppose double click here and no installation is needed and this is the very uh, basic uh, interface you are getting here so you have to put the file you can see so suppose i'm just browsing the file and i will uh, put the file okay and suppose uh, i have downloaded an iso of the bodhi linux you can see bodhi linux 7 is 76 i have also reviewed this uh, distro and if you click here so you can see the checksums are uh, generated here you can see and uh, this uh, this software actually uh, supports uh, four type of checksums you can see md5 sha1 sha256 and ha512 okay so many uh, the popular uh, ones are md5 and sha256 okay these two uh, are very popular so you can of course uh, check and uh, uncheck the uh, things uh, whatever you need so you can do that right and so so by this way you can generate checksum so you can see the md5 checksum is generated and also uh, sha256 checksum is also generated you can copy uh, these checksums also now suppose i want to verify that uh, this iso file is genuine or not so bodhi linux website uh, gave me uh, the checksum value and you can see this is in a text file and you can see uh, this is the uh, checksum value uh, they provide so just uh, double click here and copy it and now paste this and now click verify and you can see the md5 hashed matched so the md5 value uh, this value actually uh, matched with this hash function so so i can uh, say that this uh, iso is uh, correct iso or uh, this is the original iso that uh, bodhi linux uh, distributed now the second way i'm showing you guys now if you want to uh, add this uh, checksum uh, utility in the file explorer so suppose you can see this is my uh, windows file explorer or files so how uh, you can do that so for that uh, one software I have found very useful and the software name is a hash tab 
and hash tab is pretty much updated software uh, you can see and this is the hash tab uh, version 6.0 so just uh, double click here to install it and uh, this is very uh, basic uh, setup guide so just agree to the license agreement okay this is also uh, a free software okay so free to use uh, and install it okay and then finish it now suppose <coughs> i'm going to my bodhi linux iso image okay so this is the image and then right click here and then properties and here in the properties you can see now this 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 tab appears okay with this function so uh, file hashes okay so this tab appears when you install the hash tab application and this will generate the uh, hashes or the checksums okay so you can see uh, uh, it generates uh, md5 sha1 and sha256 now in the settings you are getting many type of hashes you can see a lot of hash functions a lot of hash algorithms are there so it is very much advanced tool uh, you can say that okay a lot of hash functions are there so whatever you need you can check or uncheck the things and now you can see from the clipboard it automatically uh, paste my uh, has function uh, you can see that okay otherwise just uh, delete it and uh, the bodhi uh, the bodhi linux provides the uh, checksum so just uh, paste it and you can see this is a right and md5 checksum is actually matched okay so if you change the value of something so you can see this is not matched right an alternative version of the hash tab is available and that is called the open hash tab i think that will be more advanced tool okay and it is completely uh, open source and it is available in the github so all the links of the softwares i will uh, put in the description below so you must check the description of this video now, other softwares are there but they are uh, not that great okay uh, uh, they actually uh, they are limited to very uh, uh, very few checksums okay uh, and also uh, some paid versions are there okay so i don't actually uh, need these paid softwares for the uh, file hashes so if this video is helpful for you then share it to your friends and subscribe the channel hit the notification bell icon you can join me on send super thanks okay so thanks for watching guys see you in the next video very soon till then take care and goodbye